Of course, a defender choosing to stand on the goal line and occupy an area which is in fact the goalie's domain could not expect to have the same degree of protection. Oh, why not? Why should a defender on the goal line not have the same degree of protection from the rules as anybody anywhere else on the pitch? Oddly, the scene chosen of a player being hit on the goal line does not show a player on the goal line and it does not show a ball being lifted dangerously into a defender. What was shown instead was a ball being pushed into the feet of a defender who was not on the goal line, but who was tangled with the goalkeeper in front of the goal line. There's no shortage of video clips of attackers taking dangerously raised shots at defenders on the goal line, so I wonder why they chose not to use one. To illustrate the circumstances in which a defender cannot expect the protection of the rules. This shot, edge hit shot, endangers two defenders and if the one on the goal line at the back who was sight blocked anyway had not thrown himself to ground it could possibly have killed him. <laughs> 